Uh, we're on our way to shoot the last scene of The Losers Have a Junkyard, and I gotta say, everything has gone amazingly well, too well. Uh, nobody's complaining, everybody's gotten along great. So right now, we're getting ready to shoot our next scene with uh, Lloyd in the junkyard, so... Uh, the famous Lloyd Kaufman. Yeah, we're setting up, we're just about to shoot the last scene, and we're it's good because we're just about to run out of daylight. So, uh, and Lloyd, are you ready? Blow me! I'll be ready when I'm fuck. Hey, Harvey, I didn't mean you. I didn't mean you, Harvey. Yeah, so we're we're going to have been all right. Uh, yeah, it's been a blast. It's a pleasure, really. The big name, so. Yeah. Rolling. All right, and roll sound. Whoa, whoa. And wait a minute, wait a minute. What, Lloyd, where's Lloyd? Where did Lloyd go? Oh, oh fuck. Jesus, oh, look at Come on. Oh, Larry's car. I love Larry's car. Working with Lloyd has been. Uh, I guess you could say uh, it's yeah. been a little bit difficult at some times. To put it honestly, I think it'd be best to put it honestly. I mean, he's a real dick. Yeah, but I'm sure I, ah, I can use it. Oh, hello. You know, one thing I like about making a movie like uh, Loser Has a Junkyard is that you get to work with young people. I really enjoy helping young people and and uh, sort of, you know, giving them their start. And, and we, this, this, movie everyone loved each other that it was like a love fest everybody just got along so well and and um, and and you know that's what filmmaking is all about working together a team and just brimming with sentiment and love asshole cocksucker dickhead big motherfucker the egomaniac the guy is a fucking pain in the ass Oh man, this is sucks. This is the worst piece of. Look at the you fuck. I'm just fucking Doctor Thunder, right? Doctor. Get the get the get out of here. Hey, Lloyd, we're gonna be shooting in a few hey, minutes. Huh? I, I, said, yeah, we're be shooting. I said I wanted sparkly water in my. I want the lights on. I want all the TVs on. I want it. I want the TV you're tuned. Talking. Where's you're, you're supposed to tune the TV to Fox Network? This isn't that kind where's of that guy boy. who's? Where's the guy who's no, supposed to be my fluffer, right? You said you had a young young hairless Asian boy. You told me that. Lloyd, we're working on that. We're working. No, no. Yeah, we're good. Yeah, I don't know who this Roy Kaufman is. It's a real piece of shit, I can tell you that much. He comes in here, starts bossing people around. But if he gets in my way, I'm gonna stomp his ass through the fucking ground. This is the best film experience I've ever had in my entire 40 years of filming. Larry, can you give me your car keys? I gotta use your car. I gotta go down and get some. I gotta get you. Give me the keys. One picture. Let's get the picture down. We knew this was PR. What? Fuck you. Hey. Hey Harvey, okay Harvey, yeah, Come on, yeah. It's a, picture, it's an option man. deal. Yep, it's a, it's a. It, we're gonna green light it. Yeah, you're right, you're one right. Picture, Lloyd. Absolutely. You know, I mean, you know, everything's gone great. The crew's been awesome. The actors have been awesome, but the crew has been almost perfect. And especially, I hate to sing only one person, but especially Clint on Boom. I mean, he takes it. He maybe he even takes it a little too seriously. I mean, he when I told Clint originally that he was gonna be doing uh, Boom. I mean, he started working out. He invented a weightlifting thing called the uh, boom press. Action! All right, that's great, guys. That's great. Good job, Quinn. Hell of a job there at the boom. Good job. All right, that's good. Larry and Aaron gave me a job to do with boom, and uh, they know I'm a real dependable guy. You know, I always get the job done. So, you know, two months in advance, I've been working out. I've been doing a lot of vertical presses, you know, a lot of bench presses. And I can hold a boom mic for hours at a time now. And every morning I get up and I practice. And you know, I have different, you know, angles you gotta practice. So I take it real serious. I'm a pretty hard worker, you know. It's my job. And cut. Great job, everyone. Great job. Let's take a lunch break, everybody. Let's take a half an hour lunch break. We got pizzas on the way. Great job, Arthur. Oh, wait. Hey, Clint. Lunch right, dude. Hey, what? You know, there's been times where I don't take lunch. You know, sometimes that cuts into my practice, and it just doesn't fit, you know? So, I just skip it. Clint, for God's sake, take a break and come eat with the rest of us. Hey, hey. It's like fucking boom mic. Yeah, you know, after 30 years of filmmaking, it's all led up to this moment. The Losers Got a Junkyard.